Good morning, welcome to your 10 a.m. daily weather briefing. Looking at our current surface analysis today, you can see the showers that moved through our area last night into early this morning are now off to our east. We have a cold front across the northern part of our area, going to be pushing south today. Uh, still going to be seeing some pretty pleasant temperatures today with highs in the low 70s. However, our overnight low tonight will be a bit cooler than normal uh, in the mid 40s. Now looking at our upper level wind chart today, at 1,000 feet we have winds coming out of the northwest at 16 knots, varying a bit in the lower levels and then increasing up to 71 knots at 25,000 feet coming out of the west. And our freezing level today is 11,200 feet. Now looking at our visible satellite imagery, you can see some of those clouds have moved out of our area uh, associated with those showers. Still seeing partly to mostly cloudy conditions, uh, especially with this upper level series uh, moving south towards our area along with that cold front. Uh, so we're going to be seeing pretty pleasant conditions today, however, overall uh, with that shower activity out of our area. And as I mentioned before, for our area today, we are going to be staying dry. No chances of precipitation for the next 24 hours. And picking back up with our long-term model, going to be staying relatively dry for the next seven days as well. As we move into the end of this week, we're going to be staying dry. However, as we move into Saturday, those chances of showers and potentially thunderstorms have started to creep back into the picture, looking at about a 40% chance of showers and thunderstorms. This model showing uh, the... Uh, most bullish response to these shower and thunderstorms in our area Saturday and maybe early into Sunday. Uh, but looking to move out of our area come next week, Monday and Tuesday, looking to be pleasant for us again. Now looking at our 24-hour weather risk chart today, mostly cloudy conditions becoming partly cloudy and eventually mostly clear overnight and into tomorrow morning. Temperatures today starting out at 67 degrees, looking at a high this afternoon around 72, and a low tonight again a bit chillier than average for this time of year of 45, when our average low this time of year is 55. Our winds today starting out out of the northwest, 7 to 12 knots, gusting to 18. You're going to see those winds begin to die down throughout the day, uh, becoming varied in nature uh, overnight tonight, still mainly out of the north to east direction. Uh, and then and as we move into Thursday morning, settling into a northeasterly pattern uh, with wind speeds of 5 to 10 knots. And our tides for today are normal. And as we look at the week ahead, uh, today and for the next couple of days, going to be seeing pretty pleasant conditions. Uh, high of 72 today, but highs of uh, 64 and 67 for Thursday and Friday, so a bit cooler for this time of year with that cold front moving through our area. Uh, as we move into this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, looking like a chance of some thunderstorms on Saturday, particularly during the morning, but chance of lingering into the evening and potentially early uh, Sunday morning, not expected to see rainfall during that entire period or thunderstorms during that entire period, but uh, still a little fuzzy on the exact timing of when those chances will move through. High of 76 on Saturday before those chances of thunderstorms come through, and then 72 on Sunday. And as we move into next week, looking to start our week out very nicely with partly cloudy conditions on Monday and Tuesday, highs of 74 and 72. That's going to conclude our 10 a.m. daily weather briefing. We will be back again tomorrow at 8.15 and at 10 a.m. And I hope you guys have a great day.